Hello, this is Haka Devine, and today we are going to reading The Hub, which is a level in the back rooms. A level that is actually very often referenced, but I have not actually visited yet. It's kind of a nexus point for the rest of the back rooms. Anyway, if you like this video, please like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. Now let's get right into this. Survival difficulty, zero. Safe, secure, devoid of entities. The hub is a hidden level which serves as a nexus to the entire back rooms, containing an entrance to every single level. It is a safe place for any wanderer looking to pass by and or live in. Description: The hub presents itself as a vast subterranean complex, composed of an infinite interconnected network of dimly lit tunnel systems. A dry asphalt road runs through these tunnels. The walls are lined with large slabs of concrete, with seams between each one. Yellow industrial lights also line these walls illuminating the hub with an orange hue. The tunnels of the hub twist into many directions, creating a confusing layout in some areas. The hub seems to be completely devoid of sound, making the level fairly empty. Or rather, feel fairly empty. The tunnels are lined with large concrete doors on either side, each bearing a strange symbol carved above. The symbols are unrecognizable in language, though their patterns can be likened to those of crop circles. The doors themselves are not numbered or otherwise labeled with anything else, and their order does not correspond to the order of levels in the Omeg database. Most of the doors are locked and cannot be opened without their respective level key. Each door or includes a keyhole with, in which its respective level keys inserted it to unlock it. Picking in these locks is impossible, as they contain intricate and complex mechanisms which make it impossible for anything besides the intended level key to unlock it. The doors leading to level 1, I think that's 11, and 178 are the only ones that are unlocked, and permanently remain so. The door to level 1 is in the 7th tunnel. The door to level 11 is in the 10th tunnel, and the door to level 178 is in the 5th tunnel. If you enter the hub while in possession of a level key, you can follow its resonance towards the respective level door and unlock it yourself. However, all doors have to be previously you've been manually unlocked. Why wow, did not read that right? All doors who have previously been manually unlocked always become locked once again for any subsequent entrance into the hub. Numerous entities have been found have been seen to successfully enter the hub in the past, but never reemerged from it, nor were they ever found anywhere within the level after entering it. Various entities and ancient groups, such as the Lost, have always referred to the hub as the Crossroads. However, the reason for this name is currently unknown. Entity is the Key Master. The Key Master is known to reside in the hub, serving as its overseer. It is from the hub that he travels to other levels in the back rooms. Although Oh, indeed, present in this level, an encounter with the key master is unlikely due to his antisocial tendencies. If you do indeed meet him, you may request him to write a level key to you, and or guide you to the corresponding level door of whatever level key you have, which he will be eager to do in order for you to leave. Bases, Communities, and Outposts The hub serves as a hotspot for various wanderers, Many different outposts have been made in the hub for, bringing, for various purposes, such as providing makeshift homes or trading posts. Meg Outpost Doorstep Carpet 
This serves as a ex ex hub outpost. Various different level keys are stored here before they disappear. Any wanderer can ask for level keys available to use within the hub. This is mainly where med regiment lockbreakers deposit the keys they have collected. Camp Amber Hub Outpost. This is the fourth base from Camp Amber, which originally reside on level 1. This group usually helps newcomers and teach them about the back rooms. This specific outpost will provide limited supplies for any water that comes in airway if needed. This outpost will also teach people what level they are about to walk into. This group doesn't really have a fixed point as they wander around to help others. This group is aided by the local Meg to help to further help the wanderers. Entrances and Exits Entrances Following a specific sequence of halls and doors in level 1 may lead to the hub. Given its connection to every level, it is hypothetically possible to no-clip into the hub from any given level. A rare a phenomenon exists in which doors to the hub temporarily manifest in a random level. Exits Unlocking and entering any door or in the hub will bring you to its respective level. It should be noted that the level doors are one way and you cannot return to the hub from the other side, as the doorway from within the entered level will disappear after being crossed, along with the level key that was used for it. Meg Notice The hub is larger than originally believed. An entirely new area has recently been discovered. Wanderers of the hub are advised to remain within the known area for the time being, until more information is gathered. A team from the Compass Point Regiment shall be dispatched to explore this new landscape. All future findings are to be immediately documented within this entry. That was on July 19, 2019. It was updated on July 7, 27, 2019. Attached files, Discovery Log 1782. And we don't have time to read that today. But I will make a note of it. Anyway, that was the hub. I did not read a, a level 94 discovery because I already did that in a previous video. I actually had to look through my videos to find it, but yeah, I already did that when I, I did level 94 originally. <sighs> so today I decided to go somewhere else. If you like this video, please like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. I have no idea what I'm going to be doing tomorrow. Oh wait, actually, I know what I'm going to be doing tomorrow. We're going to be reading the discovery log of the hub tomorrow, so until then, goodbye!